This Military Makeover is brought to you by Simon. We're in Asheville, New York, at the home of Cody and Jessica Willett. Cody is an Air Force veteran who at the age of 20 back in 2009 was in his fourth month of his second deployment to Afghanistan when he was injured severely by a rocket propelled grenade. Now his recovery has been arduous and really strenuous both mentally and physically, but with the help of his wife and this amazing community, he's not only gotten a fresh start, but he started a brand new career. The Willett Family Makeover, right now. Military makeover in Asheville, New York is off to a great start. Ryan's had more help than he's ever experienced before. Fantastic community support. Amazing already. Hey, Davis Drywall's here doing a great job. Brand new drywall going on, uh, ceiling looks great. And now I see why Chris Dirks is here. Dude, you just show up at the right time all the time. Good to see you. Ryan Stanley. Oh, Ryan, what are you, trying to trip me? Good to see you, man. You're killing it out here. New cabinets going on. Uh, you know what I'm missing? A wall. A big wall. A big, a big wall. wall. As you can see, once again, innovation. We got some gorgeous cabinets. Yeah, love it. Doing something innovation. a little different this time. We got the uh, pearl white cabinets on the wall and the storm gray on the island. I love that. Is that a gen thing? Um, it was a collaboration. Okay. I'm not gonna let you can, you, all you can the credit. take credit for that, but you can take credit for getting rid of those ugly sliding doors. What was the concept behind putting in French doors here? So the problem before they had these big giant sliders, which was nice for a view, but they were kind of old and they didn't open up very well. So I put in two five foot beautiful French doors, no more slider, they'll just open up. Nice, nice casing, casing, nice trim. Give more room for the TV. And it kind of ties in, if you look at the existing windows, they have the same mullion pattern as on the door. I love it. Let's look downstairs, man, because they have that killer room, it's a bar, it's a sports bar, and they want to make it sort of a kid's room as well. This, this basement's really gonna blow your mind. We've done a lot of big changes. Ryan, this is amazing. Right off the bat, that ugly drop ceiling, gone. Recessed lighting installed. Looks like we've got brand new vents and everything for the AC. Now, is this space still gonna be able to function as an adult space as well as a kid space? So yeah, that's kind of the whole plan. That's one of the reasons why we're gonna scale down the bar. This one currently takes up a lot of real estate. Yeah. So we'll still give him his bar, his kind of man cave, but we're gonna bring more furniture down here, give it a funner feel. So it's multi-purpose. He can come down here and get away, decompress. Music room, yeah. All right, well, you're making me tired with all this work. <laughs> I'm gonna get out of here and get back to work, man. Great job, dude. I'll talk to hey, you soon. Hey, don't disappear now. I'll talk to you soon, don't man. Don't pull an art. You know where I'm gonna be. Oh uh, yeah, in the trailer. While I help Ryan keep everything moving, Montel's on a mission to meet some of Chautauqua County's first responders. Hey, we're taking a little break from the makeover of the house to actually come out to the Chautauqua County Sheriff's Department's firing range where they've set up a special little exercise today. They train all the time, and Cody's a part of the team, but they're training with the SWAT team today doing an exercise that's called an active stop running fugitive drill. Cody's gonna show us what he does with the SWAT team. Not only does he use his IT skills, but he also runs the drone. Gonna take a look at this, this is gonna be really cool. So psyched, we're gonna get an opportunity to talk to the guy that's putting on this whole exercise for us. That's the SWAT team commander, Lieutenant Lyons. Lieutenant Lyons, hey sir, how you doing this morning? I'm doing good, how are you? Oh, man, thanks so much for setting this up for us. Yeah, thanks for coming. Why don't you tell me a little bit about this? This is a, what kind of exercise is this? We're doing a fleeing fugitive. So we're gonna have a car stop and the guy's gonna run from that. We're gonna try to get our SWAT team involved and get our uh, drone up in the air so that Cody can run that and try to help us out finding the guy. Now, years ago, you would have had to bring in a helicopter to do Absolutely. This, right? So it's kind of cool that now high tech is now part of the police department. Absolutely, it's a good force multiplier. We can get, it's a good asset to have. If it can see something that we can't keep our guys safe, that's awesome. You're a veteran also, are you not? Yes, I am. And so tell me how important it is to have veterans as a part of the police force. I think a lot of our good candidates are coming from the military right now. Um, they, they have a good mentality about it. They make a good transition into law enforcement. I think that's good for the, the country and good for the communities. So I guess Cody's inside right now getting ready to do his yes, drone thing, right? Let's go take a look. All right, let's do All it. Right, sir. 
Howdy, what's up, man? Hey, how's it going? Good, man. Good, good to see you at your job. All right, you guys got it from here? Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. All right, Thank get you. after it. Absolutely. Dude, come on now. This has have been a really kind of a crazy transition from the military yeah. to doing IT for a SWAT team. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, it's something I've always wanted to do after I got out. Um, and then with being injured, I can't do some of the things that I used to be able to do. Um, so I figured I'd use my brain a little bit more, and this is where it's taken me. So I'm every day learning more, and this field's uh, expanding every day. Now, when they start the exercise, there's going to be a car a quarter of a mile away. And a guy jumps out of a car a quarter of a mile away. Can you send this drone that far away? Yeah, it'll. Uh, it goes about four miles away, um, and about you know close to a thousand feet in the air. And this really does help keep the men on the ground a lot safer, right? Absolutely. So I cannot wait to see you in action with this thing. Man. Yeah, it's, it's gonna, gonna be cool. fun. Coming up. Once patrols called us in. We're gonna make a line formation and attempt to locate that subject who's got the high value items that he took from that vehicle. An important part of this makeover is insulation for energy efficiency and for sound. Looking for Ryan, Ryan Stanley. Hey, right in here, bud, how are you? Hey, how you doing? Oh, I'm insulation. John. Yes, sir, I'm John with Energy Insulation. We're, uh, we're looking to put some R19 in the ceiling here. Okay. That'll help with sound transfer between floors. That's uh, the Knopf EcoBat material. And since we have a two foot cantilever on the front of the house, we'll fill that extra cavity with the R38 bat. Goodman who came in, and this is actually duct, so there's not really much that we can do here. We'll just kind of go around it. Yep. It shoots that way and that way. Other than that, everything's good to go. Okay, sounds great. All right, my friend. We'll get Let's it put together it. for you. Thanks a lot. Knopf Insulation's EcoVat is going to improve the comfort and livability of this family's recreation space. A huge improvement. Yeah, wow, man. They said you guys are almost done. I couldn't believe it. Yeah, just putting the last piece in now. Wow, you guys rock. Well, here in the lower level of the house, we have a two-foot cantilever on the front. So the first thing we did, we used an off EcoBat to fill that space with the R38. It'll help improve the energy efficiency and heat loss out the front. And then since we're underneath all the bedrooms and this is going to be the den space for the house, we uh, put this R19, six inches of EcoBat in the ceiling for sound insulation. Yep. That'll help muffle the voices from level to level. Yeah, because right above here we got the master bedroom and both of the kids' bedroom, especially the nursery. So that's mm -hmm. going to be very important if Cody's down here and he's got the radio going or something, don't wake yeah, up the baby. This will help keep that noise level down. That's fantastic. I mean, you guys got done so early. Uh, J Dog's gonna bring the dumpster back tomorrow morning. Yep. So uh, until then, I guess you guys can knock off, go Soon to as dinner. It shows up, we'll start getting the old material out of our way. Hey man, thank you so much. All right, thanks again. You guys have a good one. Yeah, you too. We're firing on all cylinders now. Great progress at the house. So Jen heads over to Home Depot for a key design element: paint. Good morning, how are you, dear? I want a greeter at Home Depot every time I come. Well, you know, they pay me. They you pay get me. a hug. How are you? Good. Wow, I love those socks. Oh, yeah, they're a choice. Those better be PPG colors on those socks. We can color okay. match. We can color match once we get in there. So paint's going to be such a large role of this makeover because they are actually like the epitome of neutrals at their best. Okay. But I do think I need a super durable paint because they're a young family. PPG Diamond is an awesome brand, scrubbable, washable. Green Guard's a certified low VOC, oh, low emissions, and they do have a little one running around, yeah. right? So they have a four-year-old son, but they also have a new baby, so no VOC is great because it's not gonna add smells or be harmful to their family. Correct, and the finish is outstanding. They could throw ketchup at it, anything at it, <laughs> wipe it off, it's perfect. Currently at the Willett home, the walls are naked. There's nothing on them, so we're gonna put some PPG paint on it and add that soul the home needs. I need this paint to go on quickly because the Willett family is going to be home before we know it. Your team, you can put two coats on in a day, one coat, four hours later, a second coat, and it is outstanding. The eggshell, semi-gloss, satin, beautiful finishes, flat for the ceilings in your living areas, eggshell satin for your halls, your bedrooms, it'd be beautiful. It's the least we can do for these people who are putting their lives on the line to enable us to do what we do on a daily basis. Uh, we're proud to assist this, this family and to changing their environment and we're hoping that it puts them in a better spirit. Good quality paint makes my job easier and honestly like I have a lot of good colors to choose from. You do, you do and we appreciate helping Home Depot, PPG, 
we're just thrilled to be a part of this. Thank you. I know. I appreciate it. And you better not come to the house. I'll put you to work, Roy. Call me and I got a paintbrush <laughs> in my hand. We'll see. I've got your number. Bye, Bye-bye. When I go to Home Depot, it's not just about paint. Sometimes I get outdoor stuff. I love the plants. I love the outdoor furniture. I love shoving a cart full of stuff. I'm stuck. <laughs> This is how I feel getting dressed in the morning. Girl, let's do this. I'm here for you. Okay. Let me make Ooh. Doesn't look awkward at all. Paint choices done. But before Jen turns the painters loose, flooring has to go down and quickly. Joy! Hey, Jen, perfect timing. We're actually just about to lay it down the hallway. No, I love it. Yeah. It looks really good. Um, sorry, I kind of get in the way as a designer, but I love this product because we can do this makeover really fast. Yeah, you're going to see a quick transformation right now, like qu as quick as you have an old floor down and how quick we can turn it really quick into something new. Uh, I like you already, George, yeah. because fast is what we need on this, but durable because they have pets and kids. I love me some Tarket because honestly, we couldn't do this makeover without them. The product downstairs, the TruTex, honestly is fast, it looks good, it's gonna change the whole feel. Well, one of the great things about TruTex with this new textile technology, it's it's two times stronger than any other sheet product in the market. So the rip tear gouge technology, it's phenomenal. And a soft back, that's awesome. Um, I'm gonna bolt, cause I have a lot to do, and I'm gonna go see how this hallway's looking, which, you guys, that's awesome, can I walk on it? Sure. This looks amazing, thank you, thank you. See you guys later. Coming up, the SWAT team exercise with Cody's drone assist is in hot pursuit of a suspect. Fleeing in its vehicle heading northbound along White Road. Taking care of the Willett family during their makeover is job one. We've put them up in a nice vacation home. And while Cody's at the SWAT team exercise, new friends from babypage.com make their way to Jessica with special gifts. So I have two children, Carter and Kendall. <laughs> I'm still working on Carter's baby book, and he's three, and Kendall's eight weeks, and I haven't even thought about starting it. <laughs> Hello? Hi, Jessica, it's Katie, and yeah. Hi, Jessica. Hi there, how are you? We're great. We can't wait to come and meet you, but we think we might be a little lost, so we're sorry we're running a little late. Okay, no problem. I'm just getting the coffee ready. Oh, thank you. Yes, you read, you read our minds. Girls from Baby Page just called. I'm getting the coffee ready, and I can't wait to meet with them. Hi, Hi. Jessica. How are you? Really nice to meet you. We're so excited, excited to, meet to meet you. you. How are Thanks you? Thanks for having us. This is for you. A box thank of our you. <laughs> Made some coffee. Oh, good. Oh, yeah, we definitely never <laughs> enough coffee. Can't wait. So we're so excited to be here. Thank you so much for letting us join you. Thank you for coming. I'm excited to meet you guys and hear more about what you guys do. You know, we're busy moms just like you. We each have three kiddos. And the, uh, the idea for Baby Page was born when I realized I had no time for a traditional scrapbook style baby book. I started one for my oldest. Yeah. I didn't finish it. It's still <laughs> sitting at home unfinished. Maybe you can relate. <laughs> Absolutely. Carter's is not done. <laughs> right, right. Exactly. Um, and I looked for a solution online, and when I couldn't find something, we saw a really cool opportunity to build a smart platform for moms just like us. Um, so we built and launched Baby Page. So we're excited. It was really fun. We, we went in here and we created you a Baby Page account, <laughs> and we gave you a plus subscription, which for a yearly plus subscription gives you a free book along with all the perks of customizing your Baby Page. But the beautiful thing about it is when you log in, you can see that you have both your kids there and you will see prompts related to the age of your child um, and the time of year. So for example, you pull in a photo, an adorable one. Oh my gosh, she's, she's so cute, cute by the way. Your she's babies being are so like the sweetest. Over the top cute. And then you can pick one of our gorgeous frames to help kind of frame your photo and to make it look really adorable and sweet. And then we get to the questions. So can Kendall hold her head up? Mostly, she's getting there. Can she roll to her side? Not yet. Okay. Can she grip your finger? Oh yes. <laughs> What's her favorite things right now? Eating. <laughs> Mama. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Okay, so 
kind of get to the last stage. And you can customize it. You can change the color of the font. So cute. You can do all kinds of fun stuff. You can even add, if you want to, stickers to your baby page. So we could add whatever you want to add to it. So you can get in there and customize it and say, you know, Car Carter calls her boo-boo or whatever. <laughs> but if you don't have time, because many of us don't, all you have to do is hit save and your baby page is saved. So that milestone, that one month milestone is saved on your baby page platform. But you can also do it on your app, which is really helpful it's when you're safe. like running all over the place with your kids to be able to do it quickly. And then when you're ready, you can actually order a printed book. You can see we have these gorgeous frames. You have all kinds of different frames. You can do a photo collage. Aww. This is your first birthday. <laughs> I know. And then we have these beautiful overlays that just kind of frame your picture beautifully. So, so it comes see. right in the mail? Yeah. Yeah, so it comes right in the mail. So you order the book, we send it directly to you, or you can send it directly to Grandma. Mm -hmm. So it makes a great gift. Mother's Day is coming up, so. <laughs> Baby Page does most of the work for the mom and she really can edit and customize if she wants, but if she doesn't have time, she can move on and know that she captured that milestone and not feel guilty. Babypage.com has made it very simple so I can ensure that Carter and Kendall are going to have their own baby books to look back on. And for something completely different, the Sheriff SWAT team is about to kick off their training exercise with Cody's drone. So this training is going to be a suspect that's fleeing. He's going to get out of the car and run into the woods. And from there, they're going to call in uh, drone support to locate the uh, subject. Then the SWAT team will go in and extract the uh, subject. All right, gentlemen, we're here for a drill. That drill is going to be a traffic stop that's gone bad. There's going to be a subject who's fled on foot into this wooded area over here. Once patrol has called us in, we're going to make a line formation and attempt to locate that subject who's got whatever the high value item is that he took from that vehicle. Once we've located him, we'll recover that item and we'll get him in cuffs and return him back to the scene to patrol. Everybody understand their role in this mission? Yes, sir. All right. One, two, three, three. Oh. Edmonds from Military Makeover. I was just bringing you Black Rifle coffee. How do you take it? Black, cream, sugar? Good thing I wasn't a real fugitive. I would have uh, been in big trouble. There you go. Come on. These guys are going out every single day into the field and they're putting their lives in, at risk every single day on the job and they need to stay alert. They need to stay awake while they're out there knocking down doors, doing whatever it is, keeping the bad guys off the street. And our coffee is perfect for that. Hey guys, Military Makeover viewers, we have a special discount for you. Head over to blackriflecoffee.com, use code MAKEOVER20, get yourself 20% off site-wide. That includes signing up for our club, getting a couple bags of coffee, whatever you want, at blackriflecoffee.com, discount code MAKEOVER20. You know, Art, the community, the veterans, our sponsors, our partners have all opened their hearts up to the Willa family. It's been an incredible thing to witness, and uh, we're still not done. <laughs> it looks like Jen and Ryan are making some progress, though. <laughs> Either that or they're booking the next spa appointment. <laughs> well, look, make sure you tune in as the Willa family story continues with some really unbelievable donations. Tune in for the next Military Makeover.